When we became aware of the uh, studio program that Spancrete was running at the University of Wisconsin-Milwaukee back in 2007, uh, we thought that was a darn good idea and asked them if we could please borrow their model and they said sure go ahead and boy I'm sure glad we did I think now the foundation is has visited and is involved with over 20 maybe 21 universities around the country at this point and if I'm not mistaken there's about over 2100 uh, students who have been exposed to the studio we could not be happier who wins in this? Everybody. It's like this, the professors uh, who have uh, gone into this program, they didn't really know a whole lot about FreeCast either. Now they do. And of course their students do. And of course even our producers get involved with going to the universities, bringing these students to their plants, showing them how it's done. The students love to get their hands dirty, uh, form liners and, and watching everything being cast. And then the fun of going to a job site and actually seeing beams, columns, and panels being put up in the air, and they just they just seem to love it. Every 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 school that we've gone to has been uh, very enthusiastic about the program, and we've had nothing but extremely positive feedback from every single one of them, and they want to continue it. The only thing that uh, we want to do is keep it going. So. Uh, we hope uh, we hope to do that. And we got started with this, the the uh, studio program, going strictly to architectural schools, to their graduates uh, program. As it as it fleshed out, we realized that engineering schools and project managements also could uh, benefit from the exposure to this. Indeed, a couple of the universities on their own combined the architectural engineering schools. Uh, to work together in learning about precast concrete. We're very excited about that because it never happened before. And this is a terrific step forward. It's like they're talking to each other. They never talked to each other before. Now they are. It's great. I am always impressed when I go to the schools. I try to go to as many of the schools as possible. And I'm always impressed with how enthusiastic they are about learning about precast concrete. They didn't know a darn thing about it. And all of a sudden they've got this medium where they can play, just like it's like modeling clay, and they get really excited um, in finding out what they can really do with precast concrete. And this is the exciting part for all of us, in that they now have a medium that they can take into their jobs in later years. And the limits of precast concrete are just there are no limits. I mean, you can create whatever you want and it's just fun to see the students when their eyes light up and the light bulb goes on over their head that you know we're onto something really fine here and, and it's going to be a lot of fun and, and it has been. One of the things that uh, we really enjoy is at convention time we bring a good number of the uh, professors and their students to the convention and the students put up posters based on the projects that they were asked to do during the course of of the studios and so they're very proud to show what they have done and of course we're proud to have our our producers and and clients and everybody just go over and see what they're doing and it's amazing the variety and the diversity of what these young people come up with in their designs and and really it's just it's all inspiring and one of the things that actually came about after we've been into the studio program for a while is we realized that, you know what, before we start these studios, it might be really beneficial for all of us to get the professors together, all together at one place, and just talk about precast concrete. And then they can take that back to their universities and do what they're going to do. But uh, the, the synergy that has occurred at these, at these seminars is, is again just uh, the enthusiasm, uh, the camaraderie uh, is just amazing to watch and take uh, be a part of. When I first started this adventure in 2001, my wish was to fill a void that I saw that we weren't doing, and that was interacting with academia at a high level. We would do very, very little. We never really got any budget money, and this is why I set the foundation up as a freestanding organization. But I never in my wildest dreams thought that it was going to be 
as successful as it is, and it is as successful as it is because of the, the studio program. All I ever wanted to do was, was get our message out to academia so that it could filter down to the students so that when, when, when they went out to the, to the workforce that they had a, a working knowledge of precast. What I didn't foresee is the great friends that I have made at the universities, at the professor levels mostly. Uh, I, I get to meet the students but they come and go but the, but the professors are there for a good long time and I, I've made some great friendships with uh, a good many of them. Wonderful people.